Bye. And I'm Bianca Peters. Welcome to the 6 o'clock news. For the first time in over a decade, a New York sports team will come down the Canyon of Heroes, and the city is deep in preparation. The Liberty joins us now with tips on how to help our feathered friends make a safe journey through our skies. Rita, so nice to talk to you. Thanks for joining us. It's very nice to be able to speak of this and get the word out. It's important. So what makes New York kind of that ideal spot for birds to refuel on their great migration? People here and Lots of restaurant scraps all over the place. Not really. <laughs> the migratory birds are after the insects that come for, that are at the... ...of New York. One of my favorites, Flacco. Oh, May I he... thought we were going to say pigeon. Oh, no. <laughs> May he rest in peace. Yes. But, I mean, his, his death was so sad. Uh, and oftentimes, unfortunately, these birds hit windows, they hit buildings, uh, they eat tainted rats. I mean, talk about some of the, um, some of the difficulties these birds have when they are in the city. Well, particularly right now, it's for our, yes. our set right here is Central mm -hmm. Park. So I would assume a lot of people go to Central Park to see some of these birds. What would be one bird that would stop you in your tracks and you'd be like elated all day if you saw this bird? Oh, there were quite a few actually. You're ready to go. <laughs> I don't. How can you pick one? Um, okay, so Central Park must be a good place for bird watching. Any other spots in the city where well, people can yes, go? Yes, all over. Yeah. Prospect Park. Campaign though to help these birds make a safe passage. The Audubon's oh, yes. lights out. Talk to us a little bit. About about that and what we can do to make sure that these birds, you know, get to where they're wanting to go. Well, the birds, most of the birds fly at night just for the hours of 11 to 6 a.m. All right. And that would save one out of four, or three out of four birds. Wow. Interesting. And pretty staggering numbers we've there. We've lost birds. We've lost so many birds since 19. I appreciate you uh, for coming on and, and sharing a bit about this. There's a lot of information we didn't know. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, Rita. All right, we had some warm weather lately here in the city. This would be a great time to go bird watching. That's right. right. But a cool down is on the way. Nick Gregory is tracking the latest for you. And what you can expect tomorrow for the Liberty Championship Parade.